What's up everybody, Andrew Edwards here, Editor-in-Chief of GearLive.com and in today's edition of Unboxing Live, we're actually opening up, this is the HP EliteBook 1040 G1. If you are a Windows fan and you're looking for a business class laptop with consumer class design, this is it. This thing is super light, 3.3 pounds, 1080p display, chiclet keyboard, backlit keyboard, and a bunch of other stuff that I'm going to get into. Look how thin that is though. Look at that right there. Nice, right? So that is the HP Elite Book 1040 G1. We're going to unbox it in this episode and then we'll be doing a full-on review over on GearLive.com. So be sure to check that out as well. Before we jump into the unboxing, we just want to once again thank our patrons. Thank you so much for supporting us. Head over to GearLiveFans.com if you want to see what all the fuss is about. We've got a lot of giveaways going on for our patrons, prizes, perks for joining, and things like that. Again, GearLiveFans.com. And thank you to everyone who so far has become one of the GearLive patrons. Now, like I said, we're going to be getting to opening up the HP Elite Book 1040 G1. Stay tuned. Okay, so the actual box that the HP Elite Book Folio comes in, not really that impressive. Just a regular cardboard shipping box and right inside is the computer. So there's not too much of uh, an unboxing experience, if you will, but let's just see what it's like anyway. All right, so let's just pull out whatever is in here. And as far as this box goes, it's pretty much it besides one cable. So we can get rid of that box. So here you see we have the AC adapter. So this is going to plug in to the HP Elite Book Folio, this is the 1040 G1, as we already said, and then this other portion will plug into the wall and they connect here, like so. We've got the miscellaneous paraphernalia here. Um, now, this computer, the uh, Elite Book Folio 1040, does ship with Windows 7 Professional. We've got a recovery drive DVD here. Uh, operating system DVD Windows 8.1 Pro it comes with you've got Windows 7 Pro SP1 here another one of those 7 Pro SP1 and you've got uh, the application and driver recovery DVD so it's, they send you a bunch of DVDs but one funny thing is the computer does not have a DVD drop so if you get the computer which again ships with Windows 7 and you want to install Windows 8.1 Pro. You're going to need to find a way to extract the contents of this disk um, or hopefully you have maybe an external USB um, DVD drive to plug into the computer because you can't insert this into the computer and install it. Let's get into the actual device. This is the HP EliteBook Folio 1040G1. Very, very thin. That's the first thing I'm, I'm noticing as I pick it up to remove the plastic. And you can take a look there at how thin it actually is. I mean, look at that, holding it there. So this computer, not only is it thin, but it's light. It weighs in at 3.3 pounds. And on the inside, what you've got is gonna be a 14 inch 1920 by 1080 LED display. So that's going to be, that's based, that's 1080p for you um, as far as the display goes. Let's flip that around and uh, see what else we've got here. Um, you will see this grill at the bottom. It, the, the keyboard on the inside is spill, spill proof and it'll drain. Let me rephrase that. Spill resistant keyboard. Um, so you're, you're able to do, you know, small spills, nothing crazy, and it's supposed to uh, go through and drain out. And I would assume that's what this is. Uh, all about right here. You're gonna find a dock connector. You're gonna find display port right there for external monitor. You'll find yourself a USB 3 high speed port right there. Auxiliary port for headphones. Checking out the other side, you've got another USB 3.0 port there, a micro SD port, which is interesting. You've even got a smart card support here as well. Now, this USB port, which has a little uh, lightning bolt, whatever you want to call that, um, can be used for charging. The other one, this USB port, does not have that insignia, that stamp, so I would assume this one is not best for charging something like 
a tablet. You can see it has Hewlett Packard there right on front. And we'll go ahead and spin it around and open it up so we can get a look at the keyboard and the, the display. And there is the keyboard. So, as you can see here, this is a force pad taking touch input to a new level, it says. The touchpad supports the gestures you know, enhancing them with pressure sensitive force pad technology that enables control of repetitive gestures like scrolling and zooming with just a single touch. There's also NFC built in here, Intel Core i5, and this one, it starts with, you're gonna get an Intel Core i5 uh, 4300U um, with Intel HD graphics built in, uh, 4400, that's a 1.9 gigahertz. Chip dual core, as far as RAM goes, you're gonna have four gigabytes of RAM on the inside, alongside a 256 gigabyte um, SSD. So you get that fast storage, that fast access. You're getting a 14 inch display, 1080p, um, 720p recording webcam built in there as well. So it's a, it's a nice size display, especially for a business laptop, um, and especially for something so thin and light. I mean, again, this is 3.3 pounds. It is lighter than I expected it to be. I knew it was gonna be light, but just picking it up for the first time um, really got that point across that it's a light computer. On the inside as well, you've got A211, A, B, G, and N support with Bluetooth 4.0. Um, you're not gonna get A211 AC on this one just yet. And as well, you can also connect to an external dock for even more connectivity options. That's it for your look at the HP EliteBook Folio 1040 G1. It's a business class computer with consumer class features. Again, super light. It's not, I mean, it looks, look at it. It, it does not look like your typical standard business boring laptop. It looks good, good design by HP. And that was it. That was our unboxing of the HP EliteBook Folio 1040 G1. We're gonna power this thing on, put it through its paces, and bring you our full review and thoughts of the HP EliteBook Folio 1040 over on GearLive.com, so be sure to look out for that, as well as a uh, photo gallery of this machine. Until next time, I'm Andrew Edwards. Thanks a lot for watching, guys. As always, thank you to our patrons out there. Check out GearLiveFans.com if you wanna join in on getting some awesome perks, prizes, um, and exclusive access to giveaways and other things that we're doing for all of our patrons. Again, thanks a lot, and if, even if you're not a patron, thanks a lot for watching. That was your, that was our unboxing of the HP EliteBook Folio 1040 G1. Tune in next time for more vicarious thrills through opening new gear. I'm Andrew Edwards. <laughs>